guys welcome back with another video this is please room after a long time i'm back with that room uh, that room released a long ago but uh, i forget to uh, make the review so that's why i am doing this right now and i thought that i should make that video that's why i'm here so now let's get it started and first of all let me show you from the settings and what do we have so here is the animations you guys can see and of course android 11 uh, we don't have any android 12 yet this is official this is really official room and this is not vanilla version i'm using here the gfs build so you guys can easily install so no extra pay for uh, gfs so this is really cool and after that we have the system settings here and you guys will get uh, the developer option here if you want to enable them and we have the latest google keyboard so no problem and after that we have the digital webbing and pattern to controls you guys can see here they show you data and accessibility accounts and security of course we have all the features in android 11 uh, what we actually have uh, here you guys can see fingerprint face unlock and app locker and everything is just pretty much faster and I am using for uh, three days that ROM so uh, I have got huge ideas and fingerprint just one tap unlock and I got this faster than other ROMs uh, if you compare then I just I want to say that and here you guys can see the sound section and we have the uh, uh, every single customizations what actually we had on any Android 11 ROMs so you guys can easily customize and after that you guys can see here the display setting the drop theme and everything is just working pretty much fine error free brightness just I turned off right now and live display of course it's working reading mood and color calibration whatever you want if you have knowledge about red green and blue then you guys can mix all those things and then you will get a great color and here is the picture adjustment you guys can also do that no problem and after we have battery I will talk it uh, about later uh, section in this video and uh, before uh, I just want to show you the Blissify that Blissify means the huge customization and we don't know actually this all the features are hidden in that room actually uh, we didn't actually discuss about a lot about this room so that's why most of the people don't know about that customization so I'm coming it later so after before we start and uh, let me clear here is the sim card and you guys can see here I'm using here the dual sim card and you guys will get the all necessary features like Volti preferred network so many options are there if you want to use then you can use if you are uh, living in a, a low network area then this is really cool feature preferred network type so many options are there and Wi-Fi calling is also there and carrier video calling also is there if you want to use all the features you guys can do no problem and after that let me show you uh, finally here is the blissify the huge customization hub and looks a bit different uh, compared to other custom roms and here you guys can see the animations when you click on the icons it will animate so this looks really cool it looks like this and we have every single customizations uh, with gaming mode what do you need actually and here is the traffic indicator and I'm using here right now you guys can see it's working pretty much fine and here is the clock settings all the features are available in clock settings you guys can check this out and select net activity you guys can uh, change your activity uh, on a status bar uh, the traffic indicator if you want dynamic then do dynamic upload and download single upload single download or both if you want both then select that I need both so here you guys can see the charging light you guys can change according to your choice here is the battery bar customization use customizations and system icons you guys can enable like headset and whatever you need and old mobile type you guys can select and roaming indicator and volte 
so many things are there and i am uh, just using here the blissify logo here is the logo at the edge you guys can see and volti icon you guys can enable or disable or you guys can change volti icon like older sd icon volti uh, asus icon and mio 11 emui whatever so many icons are there you, you can change according to your choice no problem and after that we have show notification count if you want to display the number of pending notifications then just you guys can enable this feature no problem and display cutout actually we don't need that system uh, thing actually here we have this uh, brightness control adjust brightness control by sliding across the uh, status bar if you want to them and after that we have show brightness slider and show tiles and you guys can uh, change here the value of rows and columns in portrait or landscape mode whatever you need you can can do and here is the qs header if you want to enable header uh, like here then you guys can enable that feature and i don't need any use customizations also available there and battery estimate battery percentage everything every single customizations are available if you need then you guys can uh, enable all those things and after that we have system settings like navigation gesture and three finger swipe a screenshot you guys can take no problem like this and most interesting thing is that we guys can customize the navigation pillbar like mine you guys can see i'm using here it, uh, the bar length and the bar radius you guys can change like i'm using here the 4 db and after that of course the three finger screenshot working without any issue and i didn't get any bug actually this is really cool and pixel animation toggle home button animation this is really cool feature and it works pretty much fine and after that we have uh, like previously let me show you that adaptive playback and everything music control you guys can get uh, just like uh, a beautiful look in your lock screen if you want to enable that uh, lock screen media art you guys can do no problem and here we have some uh, high devs from recent and this is really cool feature uh, rarely people want that feature here you guys can see that if you want any application uh, which won't be shown in your recent menu then you guys can enable that feature no problem just add your application here and it will work without any problem so that's a cool feature i guess and double tap everything just working pretty much fine and i got a uh, faster animation and faster moves when you touch on your display everything is just faster app opening and closing time everything is faster and uh, charging animation you guys can change so many animations up there crop water explosion and disable whatever you need and reorient this if you want to swap volume buttons then you guys can do that no problem left or right whatever and pulse equalizer that's a feature navbar pulse uh, yeah, replacing your navigation bar here you guys will get an equalizer which will pulse no problem if you have uh, knowledge about that then you guys can do that no problem render mode whatever every color media color mode and here is the show on AOD and you guys can enable edge lighting and show always light color custom color what do you need you guys can do use kind of customizations up there and here you guys can see another uh, section of blissify here is the themes you guys can change according to your choice icon shapes you guys can change and a different look is here and pebble around a round rectangle teardrop bezel circle whatever you need type of rect so whatever and primary colors you guys can change the colors like ocean ethereal and eye solder a one plus dark whatever net and flame just click and primary color will be changed without any problem and it's status bar icon style you guys can see here so many icon style are there and this uh, make that uh, room different the other things actually you guys can see and if you want to change just click on the icons and you guys will get the change no problem and after that so here you can see it's already changed and 
get back then settings dashboard icons which is default oxygen OS 11 whatever you need you can change according to your choice and use customizations and a switch style like default contain telegram material the retro and oxygen OS 11 or uh, fluid android 12 whatever so many uh, systems are there you guys can change like this without any problem and here you guys can see never style and android asus model uh, one ui one plus just click on that and you guys will get that and just like one plus you guys can see brightness slider it will look like this and qa style you guys can change whatever and here's customizations uh just check yourself if you want to use an rgb color picker so accent you guys can change the accent color as well and see visual mode uh, visual various customizations like this and status bar height you guys can change header size rounded corner and never colors whatever you need and else clock everything so many clocks are there just choose the clock it will be set so i hope you guys understand that things and this is really cool and you guys can change here and you guys can search here whatever you need and here is the account you guys can add without any problem and let me show you the animations which is battery smooth really battery smooth without any problem and now i'll talk about battery backup and just uh, listen to me clearly uh, when you install this rom for the first time just do clean flash and uh, for the first day you guys can get some uh, battery drain issue but after using two days or three days and just complete two or three cycles of your uh, battery so just charge your battery two or three times after completing uh, full charge so you guys your battery backup will be improved and it will be fixed totally and i got some battery drain issue for the first day and after that now i am getting no battery drain issue no battery drain issue is here so it is totally zero now so just keep using rom and battery will be solved automatically no problem on that and you guys can see here the animations everything is just super fast without any problem well, and uh, multitasking is really faster and here you guys can see i'm using anx camera and uh, which is working very very good without any problem so i already made videos on that now uh, this uh, uh, anx camera is already provided so you guys can check description or check video uh, visit the channel so you guys can get that video as well and this is really really cool this is so fast you guys can easily use now let me show you some basic thing i have already taken the screenshot so here you guys can see the cpu throttling and which cpu throttle to 95 percent and this is the first time i got that result and this is really cool that and let me show you the geekbench score where is that thing here is the geekbench and i took the geekbench score when charger was less uh, less than 70 or 80 and if you have full charge and then you guys can uh, check that you will get more result and this is also good in android 11 so no problem a uh, gig bench and the cpu charging all the best no problem so by default we have that phonograph without any problem you guys can get google camera go by default and this um, whatever google chrome and anx camera you am using you guys can use uh yourself no problem and hope you guys understand everything and you guys can see the battery smooth experience here no lag no no lag not a single lag in starter i didn't get anything the battery smooth drum here so you guys can see so many toggles are there and uh, everything is working and you guys can see here the dual phone and cpu info whatever you need you guys can enable and use and night light working fine and dark theme also working pretty much fine without any issue you guys can easily use so hope you guys understand the video and if you guys like that video then please do subscribe and hit the bell icon and never miss the further update